next passion? To me, it's like, it's love, but it's like unconditional love. So it doesn't mean you only have passion for it if you can do the sport or if you're doing good. Having passion means that whatever happens, you will always love it and you need that. It's like you're at peace with loving it, how you do. Um, so I think just having passion for something means that you're willing to be invested, you're willing to work for it, you're willing to love it no matter what happens. Um, and I think passion should be peaceful. I think it, it can get out of hand with, you know, like everything in moderation, when you have too much passion, and then you start to maybe to go too aggressively or, or think about too, too many other things besides just your love for the sport or your love for that one thing. So to me, it's just unconditional love, and it should be a very peaceful feeling. I love that answer. That's great, because passion's always been a hard one to explain. And like, I've always felt love is a huge part, the main part of passion, but that unconditional love is the truth of what passion is. Yeah, I feel like if you have a passion and you have a purpose, so that they go like hand in hand. Like my passion is all, like all of our passions are gymnastics. Like we're here for a reason and stuff. Like it goes along with the preparation. Uh, purpose and passion. So I feel like all three of them kind of go together because if you have one of them, you're going to have them, like the other. Like if you have a purpose, like why, like why am I here? Like there's a reason why I'm wondering why I'm here it's because I have a passion for what I'm doing. Every one of you has something that you care about in this sport. And so if you're struggling with that passion, you need to find that little seed of what that is and foster that seed and help it grow.